Can you talk about your character in the film? Talk about my character in the film. Well, this is a very depressed guy. Um, he feels like he's been kind of ostracized from life. He doesn't fit in. He's been repressed and really angry about all that. Very, you know, one of those poor me type of guys. Everything that happens during the day, instead of saying, oh, that happens, he goes, see, always me. That's always happening to me. And has built up this anger and I think this kind of rage about what he thinks life should have been. Wanted to be wanted to be an outdoorsman and be a hunter and do all this stuff and it's it's done it's gone off the edge for him but he's a very depressed individual matter of fact doing this film i found myself rather depressed when we were on the shooting and we met on the shooting we felt you were so happy to be here mm -hmm. is that correct mm -hmm. yes i look at me now i it's one i'd never been to europe never been to France. It was an incredible experience. And here I am again, and it's another incredible experience. Unfortunately, not speaking the language is very difficult. And I find myself seeing people that are exactly the same as me, maybe the same, same job, same interest, and I want to communicate with them. I can't, so that's, <clears throat> excuse me, that's frustrating. Because everyone is so nice. It's, uh, I love it. I don't want to go home. He is Chris Bryant a good director? You know, that's an interest that, yes, the answer ultimately is yes. In the States, sometimes we do a lot of series television, and it's very quick. So there's not a lot of direction. You really expect it to know your character, get in, do your lines, get out. And when you're doing a film like this, you need direction. And so there were some ideas that Chris had that I absolutely disagreed with. I said, oh, I need to say, you really need to trust me. And I'm looking at him, he's a young guy, and I'm thinking, well, really? I gotta trust you, you're not old enough. And he was right. He made some great choices. I was thrilled. I, I have to say, he's given me some of the, the best direction I've ever gotten. He just really did a great job. Really okay. nice. Are you ready to do it, to shoot another film with Chris? Oh yeah, of course, sure. Him and, and Tomas, unbelievable. Really hardworking guys. To think that this is their first their first chance and their first attempt at making a film, that gets lost, I think. In, in what we're doing, that can be lost because the film, you always want it to be real, the best possible. But when you're just starting, you know, you kind of go, okay, if we can get to here, that would be great. But they've, they've gotten way to here. I mean, it's, it would be great to work with them again. Really, first of all, first off, they're really, really nice guys. Great to work with, good friends all become very good friends. And ready, camera rehearsal only, action! And action! <laughs> 